it never occurred to me that my belief about how learning worked was impacting my career. Because I was a classic fixer, exactly as I've spoken about, that was me. Great marks at school, always in the top five. And the first thing that I ever failed was one of my tests, test one for financial management in CTA. And it broke me. I was paralyzed for two months. I couldn't study. I was so freaked out. I'd never failed anything before. I had no experience with failure. I had no resilience. My world shattered. I couldn't study. I was so terrified to study. That is the journey of 95% of my students. Again, why does this impact you and your career? Because we take ourselves with us wherever we go. And we may not be writing exams. We may not be studying for specific topics. But we're now in a position where we are constantly standing at forks in roads that we may not even be aware of. And we are required to make decisions about which road to follow. And some of our decisions professionally may be the safe road versus the stretch road. Or, and in my case, it definitely was the case, I was walking along the road and I didn't even know. I wasn't aware that there were other roads. For me, there was no fork in the road. I was just following one road. And as I started working on and improving a growth mindset and developing and trying to develop a growth mindset, I started realizing that every road you're on and every couple of steps has pathways that you could take. Or, even scarier, you can create pathways. You create pathways for yourself that aren't there. So the same mindset that makes a student step back from asking questions in class, that makes them step back from trying to do questions before they feel ready, massive issue, is exactly the same mindset that causes us to stay on the road, to stay safe, to not step forward, and to not create our own paths, to wait for other people to tell us that we're ready, to wait for validation, to look for jobs instead of creating our own businesses, for example. Until we consciously decide to change that, this is who we are. This is who we are. 